straight ahead, a bantamweight tilt between John Dodson and Tom Duquesnois. Well, if you're a fan of the Muay Thai discipline, this guy just might become your favorite fighter on the roster. Real possibility that that's what you see tonight. Just the outstanding Muay Thai kickboxing game that he has really employed all the way en route to the UFC. Outstanding kicks, a lot of knees and elbows, punches from different angles, and any one of those could be fight enders at any given time. Scary proposition for the UFC veteran he draws here tonight. This guy has insanely fast kicking technique. If you are within kicking range, you are in a world of trouble. So here's the Albuquerque, New Mexico-based Southpaw, John Dodson, the longtime staple of the Jackson Wink MMA camp, training under the likes of Jafari Veneer, Brandon Gibson, of course, Jackson and Winkle John as well. This is an explosive power striker, outstanding speed, wrestler kickboxer who brings a lot to the table. Unbeaten as an MMA amateur, he was a state champion wrestler in high school. John Dodson still trying to chase down that elusive UFC goal. John Dodson may very well be one of the fastest and most athletic fighters to ever compete inside the octagon. If you are a fan of fast-paced action, John Dodson's technique is literally second to none. Or till the tape for this, our main event of the evening. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height and a similar reach. Here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the Sold Out Arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. It's time! Five rounds in the USC Bantamweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record of 16 wins, two losses, and one no contest. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA, Tom Fire Kid Duquesne. And now with the disease opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 21 wins, nine losses. He stands five feet three inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, John the Magician Dodson. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. Are you ready? You ready? Fight. Here we go. All right, let's see how it goes here. Early round one for the speedster, John Dodson. Joe, this might be the fastest guy on the roster. And by the way, he's never been knocked out. This is a hard shin to find, and that figures to be the case here once again tonight. Opens with the inside leg kick. All right, first round is underway. We'll see how long it takes for him to find a home for these patented, powerful overhand punches. Always a big weapon of his on fight night. We'll see how soon he can get it going tonight. He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. That one hurt. Slightly deflected. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Straight right hand now just misses. Inside leg kick is there by Duquesne Walsh. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. 
He's got good accuracy on that jab. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Oh, nice work with the knee there by Duquesne Wall. Looking to land the leg kick here. Joe misses, though. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. Duquesne Wall gets caught by the inside leg kick. Try to establish that jab. Oh! Front kick to the face! He's got him hurt here. Oh! What a leg kick! Oh! This is crazy! Oh my goodness! Just over three minutes to go now. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. Oh, these knees are really starting to pile up. Good combination of knees there by Duquesne. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Dunst. Well, the kick lands to the head there, Joe, but I got to say, he moved right into it. So let's see if he can make the adjustments, try to circle out, and at the very least, get that guard up. Not a good look for him here. Single leg takedown. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Well, this is exactly what you like to see. Nice combination of ground and pound punches. Outstanding pressure and activity by John Dodson. Back to the stand-up now. Both fighters upright. Oh, a nice inside leg kick landed there by Dodson. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Duquesne Watt gets caught with that punch. Well, you know these leg kicks, Joe, are a big part of his arsenal, but I'm not sure he's been any better with it than he is here tonight. Visibly now, his opponent has started to slow down. Exactly. Beautiful inside leg kick. Oh, lands the double jab. Those are going to start to take their effect. Nice. Very good job of timing these punches. Duquesne Wall gets hit by that kick to the body. Nice inside leg kick. Oh! There was a nice exchange. Good combination of strikes there. Missed the mark. Nice kick landed there by Duquesne. Oh, how good is that jab by Dotson? Battle for position here. And he goes to the knee to the body. Dodson's got the tie clinch. Let's oh. see what he can do. That one appeared to stun him. This could be it right here. Nice takedown. Beautiful hammer fist. Now he's inside control. Oh, that cut has really opened up now, Joe. He moves to full guard here. Well, he's staying pretty effective here, fighting off of his back. Nice strike landed there by the bottom by Duquesne Wall. Recovery, man, right back to his feet. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Pretty good jab there, Joe. He lands a clean combination. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Certainly showing off some good hands here tonight. Whenever you see a fighter's legs stiffen up like that, that's not a good sign. Nice shot to the body. Round two is next. There's a nice leg kick. And here's another beautiful leg kick. And there's another excellent leg kick. We really got a chance to see some awesome action in that round. Ariane Celeste on hand. Are you ready? Ready? Fight. All right, round two. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. 
How about that shin? Superman punch. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Oh, hook to the head by Dodson. That one hurt. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Dodson gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Look at that, right to the temple. Oh, and he ate a front kick. Oh, he continues to find the range with another punch there. Yeah, it's, it's freak. It's like he's cheating. You know, it's like he's got rocks in his gloves. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, how about the output for this fighter here? A lot of good time shots there, and they're all landing. Nice punch there by Dodson. Big kick to the head. He's stunned. Man, has his chin been tested early. Now they're both throwing with power. He is going after it here. Misses the takedown. Big knee to the body. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. He's oh. on him. He's stumbling. Oh, big left hook there. Beautiful hook. New Kane was lower jaw. Very swollen now. Time to fight down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Just out of range with that right hook. Oh, and he goes up top of the kick. Rocked him with that right hand. We got a fight, folks. Oh, big left. And now he lands a combination. Oh, he's going for it. Big body shot. Nice leg kick. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. He hurt him with that hook. Powerful left hand. Vicious combinations. He's fainting with the punch. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one. A little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm. Found oh, it. He's hurt here. Lands a powerful kick. Straight punch. Oh! What a leg kick! Nasty combinations here. Effective strike there by Duke. Wow. Oh! This could be it! This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. He's teeing off with oh. some vicious shots. Oh! Nice leg kick. He's got him hurt here. Well, Joey seems to have his opponent's timing down. He has landed oh, wow. Unbelievable. They're canceling each other out. One minute. Side control. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by John Dodson. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. Oh, he gets reversed. Full guard here. Looking for a guillotine. It looks like he's got it locked up. That guillotine was close. He's in half guard. Dodson gets back up again. Nice body kick, though. He's hurt. He's down. Oh! What a leg kick. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, so there's the end of the round, and thankfully it came right then and there for
Storm. He was knocked down pretty significantly near the end of the round. That will keep him in the fight. He goes back to the stool. We'll see to what extent he can recover. And here, another clean shot lands and another knockdown. What an action-packed round. It looked like it almost ended on multiple occasions. The beautiful Jenny Andrade getting us going. to pick up where he left off. Man, I could watch this guy all day. He continues to land a high number of strikes just as he did the previous round. And at least to my amateur eyeballs, Joe, he's not showing any signs of slowing down tonight. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Duquesne was lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. And he continues to work the body here. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Oh, nice head kick. Oh, effective strike there by Duquesne. Oh! Back to his feet again. Amazing. Whoa! Wow! Gigantic right hand for the KO. Yeah, Joe, beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Here it is one more time. Boom! Right on the button. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop for this contest at 55 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Tom Firekin Duquesne. So there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way at the end of the night, I'm not sure. Still a few fights to go, but at the very least, you can be sure. His next fight will be a big one, and he will celebrate deep into the night with his teammates, his coaches.